I'm here at Richmond Comics in Midlothian, Virginia, scene of the 2015 April Footsies Fighting Game Tournament. And right behind me, a bunch of guys are getting ready to duke it out on screen for pride and prize money. It's going to take more than button mashing to win one of these tournaments held by the RVA Fight Club, a group of dedicated fighting game players from Richmond and the surrounding areas. The group has over 500 members on Facebook, and these tournaments are a hotbed of competitive fighting game action. To organize a fighting game tournament takes a lot of patience. Uh, it's kind of like herding cats. The scene is more than just guys beating each other up in video games. Many of the group's members have developed long-lasting friendships with each other steeped in fighting games, and they take great pride in their community. I met a lot of people through uh, playing these fighting games. A lot of good friends I've made. Playing with them, something else will come up in conversation, like a band or something. You're like, oh, dude, I love that band, and there it is. To become a master fighting game player, it takes more than good hand-eye coordination. The best players practice their moves in combos for hours every day to gain an advantage in the arena. I practice about 20 hours a week, maybe more. It's, it's a lot. The best pros compete in an event called Evolution, or EVO for short. The event will take place July 17th through 19th in Las Vegas this year, and every year the crowds get bigger. It's, it's a lot bigger than final rounds and other tournaments like that. It's the biggest in the world, in fact. While EVO is the ultimate arena for fighting game aficionados, most will never make the journey to that mecca of fighting games. Many are fulfilled by beating their close friends and becoming the king of their local scene, and many more just play for the love of the game and to strive to improve. For VCU News, I'm Gary Bird.